online over the age of 45 40 and trying to be a motherfucking mess. A motherfucking mess. So the real reason why I would not fuck with Adonis, nor would I ever conversate with you is because, bitch, me and you are not the same kind of people. Me and you are not the same kind of people. I'm never scared of you, bitch. You're not a king. He was never a king. Smile. King, smile. I have let y'all slide away with that shit for a long time. And one thing about me, bitch, I come with receipts. This is your mom. This is the lady pussy you came out of. Telling me that I need to go back to stealing the Fendi bag. Bitch, you couldn't afford it. Since you said I need to go get the motherfucking Fendi bag. Bitch, I know exactly what you talk about. You couldn't afford it. It was a $4,000 Fendi bag, baby, and you couldn't afford it. You couldn't afford it. You couldn't afford it. Baby, I ain't never make up no drama with you. Let's up. Oh, get out the comments and get on the live, boo. That's what I like. Eh. You know that. You know I give it to you. Like how I give it to you. Get up. Y'all know what's going on on the Wagwan motherfucking hotline. Get off the. Get out the motherfucking comments and get on the motherfucking live. And I thank you. And I thank you. Where you at, boo? Cause when I was scared of you, go live with. Doing it, you will be challenged. Let me sit in the message chair. Don't decline. Don't decline the comment, boo. Anything you say. Or do will be able to get you in the quarter loop, baby. Don't decline. Don't decline. Get out the comments and come to the line. Because one thing I never did was I never disrespected y'all. I never disrespected y'all. I never in my life disrespected y'all. I have every receipt from when they said that I was on this show. I I, I have every receipt, Adonis, of what, what you and your family and everybody said about me. Y'all heard my motherfucking feelings. And I never not once said anything about y'all. So prior to you coming on this show, I already knew that you would sneak this and hating on me for what God gave me. At the end of the day, at the end of the day, deep down, we from the same motherfucking city. So I would have never made you feel no type of way if you would have got on a motherfucking show. I would have congratulated you. I would have patted you on the back. It was bitches out there that's from Florida, like motherfucking Kilo, that gave me a pat on the back. But what you did was you went in the comments and you told me that I didn't deserve it. You told me I didn't deserve it. And now... Weeks later, you get on the show, your mama telling me I need to go steal a Fendi bag. Let's be for real, bro. We already canceled one nigga for trying to belittle me about my past. Let me tell you bitches something. You bitches will never make me have to go back to nothing that I was doing. Big home. Big home. God blessed me with everything that I have. And I let y'all get away with that shit. I let y'all get away with that shit. Come on, bro. I'm a real nigga first. I'm a puss ass nigga second, bro. Y'all can never try to make me, y'all can never try to make me feel no type of way. I just showed the people what your mama said. That was your mama. Never disrespecting her. Never said nothing about her. Never. Never. I never. I never. I already tried to add a diamond. He declined it. I never. But you linking up with, you linking up with Ara. Y'all coming up with narratives trying to make me feel like, make, make me feel like I'm this weird ass bitch. Like I'm scared of you with Donna. You're not a real motherfucking me, bitch. I'm a real city bitch. When I was ever scared of you. For what? Why would I ever be scared of you, Adonis? For what? For what? Bitch, you know me for real, bitch. You know me for real in real life. Ben getting out there. Ben gonna pull up to the fight. Ben come out all day. What, what do I gotta be scared of? Don't get out the comments and get on the live. Because I have every receipt to pull up. I have every receipt I'm gonna pull up. I'm gonna pull them up again, baby. That was okay. We seen that your mom. That was that was not too long ago. Your mom told me that I need to get back to what I was doing. She hurt my feelings. She said that I basically need to go back to stealing. She don't give a fuck about me, right? Let me see one of these. Man, this shit some real Florida water. Water. Remove these bisexual clout takers. Clout chasers. It's people from Florida on the cast. They just not known. Who you talking about, Adonis? This you. This is you. When they, oh baby, one thing about a motherfucking receipt, one thing about a motherfucking receipt is they don't motherfucking lie. Adonis, this is you. I smell, I smell hell. I, I, I smell a motherfucking jealous bitch. This is you. Who not know? It's people from Florida on the cast. They just not know. The punk, them punks better stop. They ain't. What you talking about? Who you talking about? This you, Adonis. This you, Adonis. Pull them up. Pull him 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 up. I bitch, I don't 
play with that bitch. If I'm going to bring up something, baby, I'm going to have every motherfucking receipt. Here we go again. Oh, is that I got that screen? So, oh, shot. Nah, 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 nah. This y'all. And I have not addressed not one of these things because you know why? I'm a real bitch first and I'm a puss ass hoe second. At the end of the day, after, before I put the next one up, at the end of the day, I've never a dinosaur in my life hated on the next nigga, bro. At the end of the day, I knew that deep down you felt like that was your moment and it was your time for you to get on the show. But baby, you came at me for what God gave me and told me that I didn't deserve it when I worked my ass off for everything I did. Puss ass nigga. I ain't never have no motherfucking fans on Instagram, bitch. I ain't never have no motherfucking fans, bitch. I was working in the motherfucking field. I was styling these bitches when these bitches wasn't giving me no motherfucking money. I was styling these bitches, working my ass off behind the scenes like a real bitch. Talk about a motherfucking friend, bitch. I was working, bitch. Talk about I got on there with my motherfucking friends, bitch. I was working, bitch. I was putting in work for real. I ain't shit out here, freak nigga. I ain't shit out here free, nigga. I work for everything I have. This shit, this shit right now that I'm building with this walk one hotline, it's everything I have. I don't stay with my mama. Fuck, nigga. I don't stay with my mama. Walk around talking about you the king of Miami. I could have been muddied your ass out. You are over the age of 30 years old. You stay with your motherfucking mama. You mess up people motherfucking dresses. And you have goals in your mouth because your teeth are rotted out. It ain't shit by the king about you. It ain't shit a king about you, bitch. And I let you have that lame ass line. I let you have that lame ass line. But the real Miami know you, bitch. A king never has to say that he's a motherfucking king. Never. Let me pull up another motherfucking receipt. Because I know at the end of the day, I know at the end of the day, you got banger, y'all taking banger, and y'all messing with banger mind. And y'all trying to make banger feel like there's issues. Me and banger could have been the best of friends. But he's around you, an evil, hating ass bitch. Why would I be your friend, bitch? You stay with your mama. We is not the same. You don't pay rent for real. You 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 know one of them bitches. Y'all know one of them bitches that be mad. That be mad that y'all not that you don't want to be their friend. So they choose to be an enemy. One of them bitches that's mad that y'all not friends. So they choose to be an enemy. Stop motherfucking. Man, me, bitch, everybody from Miami know you fuck up bitches' dresses, bitch. You just fucked up that little girl dress, ruined her whole motherfucking prom to run your punk ass up to do a motherfucking bad boy show. What you ain't even give a good deal on. Stop playing with me, bruh. I let y'all get away with all that shit, bruh. That shit hurt, bruh. Y'all weird as fuck for real, bruh. That's some weird ass shit. I just showed them what your mama said in the motherfucking comments, bruh. I never lie. How the fuck? That look, bro, your old girl telling me I need to get back to doing what I used to do, bitch. You think that you think that you God? You think that you got the calling on my you know, on my life and I'm still not gonna be disrespectful to your mama, bro. At the end of the day, I respect my elders. I'm just mad as fuck that somebody from my city could do some fuck ass shit like that. So, think you think you think it's gonna blow up? You think it's gonna blow up? You think you think anything gonna come out of this career is over? You lame as fuck for real, bro. You ain't no king in Miami, bro. You can't bro, you can't bring out no raw bitch. You can't bring out no raw bitches. No raw bitches. Come on, bro. I know the real you. What you talk about? I ain't shit about you raw for real, bro. All that fake ass shit y'all wear. All that fake ass shit y'all doing in the flea market. Put that ass off. Your mama been in the flea market forever. Y'all wear fake shit. And I ain't, never, I ain't never even bother you. I just ain't want to deal with you, bitch. Because y'all know that's not where I come from. Bitch, one thing about it. If I stole any motherfucking thing, bitch, I stole it. I don't give a fuck. And it's real. I don't never got a fake shit. Hold on, let me find the rest of these screenshots. That shit hurt for real, bro. And I let y'all ass get away with that shit for a long ass time. And I never addressed y'all and I never did anything. Because at the bottom of my heart, I probably understood that you felt like you deserved that spot. But bitch, if you feel like you deserve a motherfucking spot, don't never come trying to knock my motherfucking spot. Losing ass bitch. You a losing ass bitch. You old. You're miserable. You're mad. Fuck is you talk about? You're old, you're miserable, and you mad. And half of the shit that I can't say on this motherfucking live are in you. But I ain't even that kind of faggot for real. Bitch, cause you know I know the real you. I ain't even that, I ain't even that kind of faggot for real. But one thing you ain't gonna do, put that up and tell me I'm scared of you, put that up. Cause I'm really from Miami. I'm really from Miami. Don't be mad at me cause I was a motherfucking original. I ain't no motherfucking replacement loser. Egghead ass, alligator head ass bitch. Kangoo head ass bitch. Stop playing me all that cheese ball ass shit, bitch. This is my home. This is my home. I buy my mama an apartment before I lay up with her. Stop playing me. You too big for that. Stop it. Stop it.
We would never be friends. Don't be mad at me because I never wanted to be your friend because we're not in the same boat. And some people just don't understand that. Some people don't understand that we're not on the same level, bitch. You keep trying to make us be on the same level, and we're not. We're not. Yeah, I used to boost. What's next? Your mom said I need to go back and sit in the Fendi bag. What's next? What's next, bro? What's next? Y'all gonna stop trying to make me feel like I, 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 my, my, my wagwan see me, baby. We building, we building wagwan hotline right now, baby. Bitch, get you some motherfucking money, bitch. Get out your mama house. You, you laying up with another faggot in your mama house. That's some cheese ball ass shit. How the fuck I'ma be your friend, bro? You was, you was making motherfucking clothes since I was in high school. How the fuck I'ma be your friend, bro? Never disrespect you, player. Fuck you, man. I kept that shit a stat. Never hated on you. Just, just, you, 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 you just ain't my kind. You just not my kind. You an old ho. And bitch, when you do get on my life, take the motherfucking goals out. One thing about a king, they smile. One thing about a king, they have purpose. Kings don't call themselves kings. You know you ain't no king of Miami, bitch. You know you ain't no king of Miami, bitch. But I let you have that. But it's over now. So you have to take that down because it's over now. Everybody know. You thirty you're over the age, you're 30 years old, you stay with your mama, you don't got no money, you got wet fake shit. You've been doing clothes since we was in school. You've been running off on people's clothes. The whole Miami knows that. Like first somebody to play with and I just and the whole shit started because I have let them for the people that haven't seen I have let him and his mama talk about me for a long time that's what really bothered me when his mom told me that I need she made a comment that I never responded to because I have respect bitch I have respect this is not this is, this is mama again this is the comment that made me very mad she said banger tell him he need to just get back to doing what he used to do Bitch, I would never get back to doing shit I used to do. I would never get back to doing shit I used to do. I don't have to. Y'all bitches is weird. You hate that bitches is weird. Bitch, I pray for everything in my life. Y'all is weird. Bum ass ho. I'm going to make sure when I get to the top, you always don't make it. Bum ass ho. Fuck you. Y'all is weird, bruh. Y'all is weird, bruh. And we from the same motherfucking city. But instead of you acknowledging a young white nigga like me from your city, you rather jump on another nigga from all the way across the United States and call me a motherfucking loser and tell me I need to go back doing what I used to do, man. I never respect y'all, bro. All jokes aside, bro. I don't give a fuck about y'all, bro. All jokes aside, bro. At the end of my motherfucking, at, at the end of this motherfucking line, bro. I make sure you will never make it, bro. I got so much shit in store that's coming up for my life, bro. I'm gonna make sure you never make it, bro. You chose the wrong thing to do. That shit hurt, bro. Y'all can hear the hurt in my motherfucking voice. And I never even responded to this lady. This lady is too old for that, bro. That's the same shit Chef D said, bro. Y'all bitches is mad. Y'all bitches is mad, bro. That shit not cool, bro. Fuck what you got going on, bro. Stop playing with me, bro. I'm a real bitch. Let me go back to all that other shit, bro. Because I, I, one thing about being new, bro. I keep a motherfucking screenshot, bitch. You think they gonna be on your team? Bitch, you, you ruined it, bro. You a lame ass nigga, bro. You ruined that little girl motherfucking prom just to run to motherfucking Texas and do Natalie Neese for a motherfucking dress and make her feel good. But you messing up bitch and shit from your own city. Bro, you's a loser. You's a lo loser, bro. Man, get out the comments. Get on a motherfucking live, bro. I'm ready to talk to your ass straight up. Stop playing me, bro. Stop Playing me, bro. That's some losing ass shit, bro. I got every screenshot. No adult, bro. Let me tell y'all something. No adult, bro. Or nobody mama should ever get on a motherfucking live and insert themselves and say some hating ass shit like that. They let me been in Miami all her motherfucking life. And to hate on somebody two times younger than her and tell them that they need to get back to doing what they used to do. Let me tell y'all whole something. I wouldn't give a fuck if you sold pussy for 10 years straight. Bitch, if you change your motherfucking life, don't let nobody take you back there. Don't let nobody take you back there. And fuck. Fuck that. Fuck that shit, bro. Y'all got me fucked up, bro. I'm like, yeah, yeah. That's my move. Yeah, yeah. Never hated, bro. I never hate. I was never a hater, bro. I never hated on this man, bro. I never hated on you. I never did that. I let you rant. I let you rant. I let you rant. I let you rant and rant and rant and rant and rant and rant, bro. I never said nothing because at the end of the day, bro. I know how I feel to want to want to do something different. I know how I, I know how I feel to want to change your life, bro. So when they when 
some people probably ain't accept this man, bro. I was like, bro, at the end of the day, bro, that probably could have been me. Because there was thousands of other people that went out there, put their money and went to that audition, bro, that really felt like they had the motherfucking personality to get on that show, bro. So I never doubted nobody, but a nigga from my city. So when you came on that show, I just felt like it was nothing to talk about. It was nothing to talk about. We never talking in person. We ain't talking in person. We not on the same level, bro. That shit dead. That shit dead. Bro, I, 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 bro, that shit. I'm here talking to my nigga, bro. Your mama said that shit about me, bro. I'm not on that shit, bro. Y'all want to talk in person now, but y'all want to get in the comments and tell me I need to get back to what I do, what I used to do, bitch. I know, I know, I used to sell a penny bag, bitch. I ain't never steal Nike. I know I used to sell penny bags, bro. I ain't shit I sold was cheap, bitch. She couldn't cop up that two thousand dollars, bitch. I have real rent.